well here in this video we are solving a small problem the problem is trying to find the dimensions of stress so it's very simple first of all we shall know what do you mean by stress is so if you remember stress is defined as the restoring force acting on a wire or a body per unit surface area which comes from where you will get further a hook's law that stress is directly proportional to strain so stress is force by area force is mass into acceleration by area of cross section mass is capital m acceleration is rate of change of velocity in terms of dimensions by area of cross section that implies velocity can be written like rate of change of displacement by time is there so 1 by time that is the numerator area is square of length so m l t power minus 2 in the numerator that is uh, force by area that is l square so l square per grid becomes m l power plus 1 and minus 2 becomes l power minus 1 t power minus 2 that's the dimensions of stress so it's a very simple question very easy question this question is asked only to make life of the people physics people physics students easy so that you will go and write the other questions with a lot of confidence so look at the options that what's available there m l power minus 1 t power minus 2 is the option c that's available that's the answer for the question there is nothing much to discuss about it it was given in neat september 2020 and uh, so i think it's like a very simple question stress uh, in another sense if this is acting from every direction on uh, on a body that's also called something like pressure so pressure also will have a same units and dimensions of that stress right that's it thank you for watching